Yeah, rough framing inspection completed. Let's talk about making money with the dump trailer. All right, I'm wearing pink because October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Have you ever been in your family? Tell them to do the routine, routine exams. It helps, it saves lives. Um, highly recommend it. Now let's get into the uh, video. All right, so we're getting about half full here. I know it looks like a lot, but we got plenty of space up front. So how I make my money with this is obviously debris removal with my job sites. I charge the customer for it, but there's all also a bunch more avenues of uh, income you can do. And let's talk about it. Let's get into it. I can let you know what I'm what I'm thinking, what you can do with your dump trailer and why it's, a, it's a, such a great income producing asset. All right, so re revenue sources for the dump trailer, obviously the main one for I, what I use it for, actually the only thing I've used it for right now um, is debris removal for my job sites. Um, depending on where you're at, some places are super cheap, some places are like, or we are pretty expensive, like it's a minimum of $175 uh, to dump uh, the dump trailer. Just no matter if you have a five pounds in it, minimum five yard, they charge by the yard, so minimum of five yards. So. Yeah, um, so it's, it can get kind of expensive, but you charge accordingly. Obviously, you have your prices. I, you know, you, fifteen-yard dumpsters don't go for anything less than four hundred around here. If they do, it's people who just don't know. They don't value their own time. Really, it's it's ridiculous. So, um, debris removal, the best, the the main one that I use this dump trailer for. Absolutely, um, it's not only I don't you know it's I charge you know the four hundred dollars per week. Uh, for the trailer, but it's also there on a job site when I need it. So if I don't have any place else to do, nothing else is, I don't need anywhere else. I'll just keep it at that job site because when I'm working, I can just chuck, you know, it's super convenient. I can, whenever I need to, I can just chuck something away, which is awesome. So now, um, so if you don't want, if you have the dump trailer and that's not all you want to do, uh, you can also do, you can put ads out on either Craigslist, you know, Facebook, wherever you want to. And you can do, you know, rock and gravel deliveries for customers because not every not every contractor has a dump trailer, so they might need something, or customers might need you know a certain amount of uh, certain stone, crushed stone, stuff like that delivered. So you can obviously offer offer that. Um, just gotta know your prices for you know your queries and all that kind of stuff. So next one would be probably you could do easily easily do uh, dry, advertise for driveway installs. Like I could, you know, you just hey, we'll do driveway installs. You go rent a skid steer deliver you know use a dump trailer to deliver it to the job site go get your rock you know use the spreader gate your tra your trailer should have a spreader gate your dump trailer should i mean they should be pretty standard now but if there's not you're going to need probably it helps for one and you could spread it and use the skid to you know to compact it and to put it where you need to so easy driveway installs for gravel dri you know gravel driveway installs fantastic you know another another thing you can advertise with it as well um, you can do, you know, gar trash removal. You know, it's like got junk, you know, we can come by and haul it away for you. I'm not sure there's a, you know, it's not probably a great revenue source for it, but it's something that, you know, keeps the trailer making money for you. Um, that's another option for you as well. And then probably my least favorite thing would, I'm, I'll never do this, um, but I could, you know, you can rent the dumpster, the trailer out to, you know, somebody else. I don't say I'm not going to do it, but it's probably my last thing because, uh, for one, you know, you can't really control what people put in your trailer. They can just be, you know, they, they it's not theirs, so they don't care about it. So <laughs> they'll throw, you know, drop big stones from way up high to see if they can puncture your trailer or throw things at it. You never know, right? So, um, you know, dumpster rentals, but uh, you can, you know, rubber wheel, driveway friendly dumpster rental because it's going to be on wheels, obviously. Um, that's a, that's actually kind of big because there's a lot of driveways, you know, you're, if it's, you know, paver driveway or, um, you know, they don't want uh, huge trucks on their driveways. You can do dump trailers because le less stress in the driveway, less cracks, all that good stuff. So uh, that's basically my main ones. I think that's what, like five, six or so, give or take. Um, yeah, that's what I've got for it. It's been a great app revenue source for us. Um, absolutely asset. And it's, it's we're, we're moving here pretty soon. So we're going to, I'm going to empty that dump trailer, clean it out, wash it out. And we're going to be putting crap in it so we can haul it away. Right. So. All right, guys, like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next video.